Praise the Lord. It's January the 10th, 2016. I've been reading Psalm 102, and the Lord's given me a very soothing melody for this. This is a beautiful psalm. It's a psalm, though, of someone who's in distress. And the consolation that comes is not in the deliverance that the Lord brings, but rather the consolation comes in his unchanging nature and his dealings with the sons of men. He is the awesome almighty God who reigns upon the throne forever. And as I've been reading this psalm, one of my favorite scriptures continually comes to my mind in Hebrews 13, 8. It says, Jesus Christ, Yeshua HaMashiach, the Messiah, is the same yesterday, today, and forever. And in Hebrews 12, 2, it says, Looking unto Yeshua, the author and finisher of our faith, who for the joy that was set before him endured the cross, despised the shame, and is set down at the right hand of the throne of God. Father, I just dedicate this to you. Take these hands, Lord. Take these lips and use them. Manifest your songs, Lord, and take these, your word, even unto the uttermost parts of the earth, I pray. In your name, blessed Yeshua HaMashiach, my Messiah, my Savior, forever the same. Hallelujah. The Lord put in my spirit, as often happens when I'm singing songs of majesty and glory of the Lord, he gives me a tonality that's somewhere between A flat and A. It's in this case, I heard 35 cents above the key of A flat. So if you're playing along with your own piano at home, you may have difficulty with the pitch or your guitar, you're going to need to tune it if you want to play along. But I need to keep it in that key because that's the key the Lord is speaking to me. And there's something that manifests in that key, something of majesty. Psalm 102, beginning at verse 12, verse 21, and verse 27. But thou, O Lord, shalt endure forever, and thy remembrance unto all generations. Thou, O Lord, shalt endure forever and thy remembrance unto all generations thou shalt arise and have mercy on Zion for the time to favor her has come to declare the name of the Lord in Zion and his praise in Jerusalem when the people are gathered together and the kingdoms to serve Yahweh. Hear my prayer, O Lord. Hear my prayer, O Lord, let my cry come unto Thee. Hide not Thy face from me. In the day when I am in trouble, incline Thine ear unto me. In the day when I call, answer me speedily. 
For my days are finished like smoke And my bones are burned as a heart My heart is stricken and withered like grass So that I forget to eat my bread by reason of the voice of my groanings and my bones cling to my flesh I'm like a pelican of the wilderness I'm like an owl of the desert I watch and am as a sparrow alone upon the housetop my enemies reproach me all the day and they that deride me are sworn against me for I have eaten ashes like bread I've mingled my drink with my weeping because of thou indignation and wrath for thou hast lifted me up and cast me down. My days are like a shadow that declines. And I am withered like grass. But thou, O Lord, shall endure forever and thy remembrance unto all generations thou shalt arise and have mercy on Zion for the time to favor her has come For thy servants take pleasure in her stones and favor the dust thereof, so the nation shall fear the name of Yahweh, and all the kings of the earth shall fear thy glory. When shall the Lord build up? Oh, when the Lord shall build up, when the Lord shall build up Zion, he shall appear in his glory. He will hear the prayer of the afflicted and not despise the cry of their heart. This shall be written for the generation to come, and the people which shall be created shall praise Yahweh. For he has looked down from the height of his sanctuary from heaven. Did Yahweh behold the earth? To hear the groaning of the prisoner, to loose those that are appointed unto death, and to declare the name of the Lord in Zion, and his praise in Jerusalem. When the people are gathered together and the kingdoms to serve Yahweh, and the kingdoms to serve Yahweh,
He weakened my strength in the way He shortened my days I said, oh my God, take me not away Take me not away in the midst of my days Thy years are throughout all generations But Thou hast laid the foundation of the earth And Thy heavens are the work of Thy hands They shall perish, but Thou shalt endure Yea, all of them shall grow old like a garment and a vesture but thou O Lord shall not change them and they shall be changed but thou art the same and thy years shall have no end the children of thy servants shall continue their descendants shall be established before thee, before thee, who art the same. Yeshua, the author and the finisher of my faith, who for the joy endured the cross, despised the shame, and is sat down at the right hand of Yahweh, looking unto him, the finisher of my faith, today, yesterday, and forever, Lord, thou art the same, my of all of my troubles forever you remain the same forever you are Yahweh I am that I am is your name
forever And thy remembrance unto all generations Thou shalt arise and have mercy on Zion For the time to favor her has come To declare the name of the Lord in Zion pass away and his kingdom shall not pass away yesterday today and forever Yeshua HaMashiach is the same looking unto the author and the finisher source and the finish of my faith, Yeshua, my Messiah, forever you reign. He is seated at the right hand of Yahweh. our comfort, our strength, and we worship you this day. Thank you, Lord, for your psalms of reassurance. Psalm 102. Thank you, Yahweh.